Collector here with another video. Before the video starts, I want to let you guys know to make sure you hit that subscribe and notification button. It really helps out showing the support for the channel. I do a bunch of other stuff besides gaming. I do drawing, building, collecting, uh, workouts, cooking, um, and then a bunch of other cool stuff with my friends. Um, and if you want me to put me posting more videos each day, make sure you hit that subscribe button and let me know. Uh, but besides that, let's get right into the video. All right, so I have the Daredevil uh, from the Spider-Man Retro uh, Figure Wave. Uh, I found them at my Walmart. I was super happy when I found them. Um, so here's the front. Here's Daredevil on the board. This is a different Daredevil than I'm used to seeing, actually. But. Here's the Spider-Man logo from the animated series, which was my favorite animated series. Still is. The other ones kind of don't have that feel anymore. I like, uh, here's the side, here's the back. If you want to pause and let me fix the reflection there, or maybe. If you guys want to pause and read this, you can. And then here's a little art from, I think the front too. Same thing as the front. Um, and then it shows swapping heads. And then here's the figures in the wave with Spider-Man, Electro, Peter Parker, Green Goblin, and Gwen Stacy. And yeah, let's crack this thing open. All right, here's Daredevil out of the packaging. So he has a few, a lot of accessories here. Start with his hands. So he comes with these shiny red uh, grabbing hands for his batons. He has fisted hands, one for each side. And then he has two of these bracelets here. Um, and the reason why is because he has another one that holds the batons. They're different. They're, you cannot, these are not the batons that you can remove. I wish they could have implemented that instead of just having two different batons, like bracelets. But yeah, there's two of those. And then here are the actual batons. Just gray. Nothing that we haven't seen before, and then same thing, just pour them in like that and it makes it into a staff. Uh, and then here's his uh, head. Um, shoot, I'm trying to figure out his name now. I'm trying to figure out Daredevil's actual name now. Um, I don't quite remember. I It's like in the tip of the tongue, but I don't remember. Um, but he has red glasses because he's blind. He has red hair? I thought he had brown if I remember, but and red hair looks really good, but yeah, and it can you could see a little gapping there from for the hair, but they did really good with the hair with the shading and stuff, so good job, and then here's the actual figure, let's go over to the looks, so the mask looks good, just all black with the red eyes, Looks good, red, nice shiny red going on, metallic red kinda. And then some gray for the uh, shoulder pads. All black, like the, like the design of the suit. Here's his logo, Air Devil. Nice knee pads, red, sh red detail, more pads for his uh, feet, I mean, the, his thigh and then uh, calves. Yeah, and they did it really good on hiding the pegs there. That's a really good job. They did really good. Nothing. I, I can't really complain about anything really. It's not. I, I think they did a good did a good job on the paint too. I don't see any mess ups on here. So really good. Um. So if you just wanted to take out, want to use those bracelets? I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use having wearing one of the baton. Having. I'm gonna have him holding one of the batons here, so I might as well take it out. Oh, there we go. And then just pour that in there, just like this. Is this right away? Yes. Yep, this hand. There we go. But yeah, just do that if you want to switch to regular batons. Um, and then yeah, let's go over his articulation. So his head can move down that far, pretty good. Up, pretty good. My figure's still a little stiff. Um, and no head pivot, really. 
arms can move up that far, mainly because it's kind of restricting it to 360 rotation. It's a soft plastic too, which is good, but not soft enough apparently. Yeah, um, no butterfly joint. I would think you would have one. Bicep swivel, but same thing. This kind of gets in the way, but you can try to get around it. Double jointed elbows. That other joint's not working, but this actually makes it past 90 degrees, which is good for me. Uh, his wrists can hinge down that far, up that far, 360 rotation. He has an ab crunch, so he goes down that far backwards that far he has a waist swivel his he could kick out that far kick forward that far kick backwards that far he has a thigh cut double jointed knees uh notion cut surprisingly and then his ankles can pivot i don't want to break them shoot i i i, I don't let's try the other one I'm guessing that's as far as it goes. Or this is stiff. Extremely stiff. Okay. Other one? Nope. Okay. Uh, yes, I do want. I, I really don't want to break him. So. Uh, the ink, the only problems that I have right now are the, the ankles. But. I'm, it's okay. I can figure something out. I'm pretty sure. But. Uh, yeah. Really good figure. I like the design of it. The only problem that I have is the ankle pivot which i meant not ankle pivot you can get him to pivot he has nice ankle pivot but his ankles are just stiff and i don't want to break his foot off so I'll, I'll figure out some way to get him nice and stood up but yeah that's the only problem i it's without the ankles moving forward and backwards kind of hard to get him to stay balanced and posed up but really good figure um, I'll figure out something to do for the ankles, but that's really the only problem that I have with them. Um, but yeah, that's all I've got. And a winner for reposting this on the story and guessing the character right, which is the Spider-Man Retro Wave Daredevil, um, goes to Pack Foes. Make sure you check him out. He does really cool photos, and he also has a YouTube. Check him out. Link in the description. And these are the characters that will be revealed tomorrow. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out my buddy's Instagram page at Highlight Photos. He does really cool photos. Also, my two best friends that I usually play Call of Duty with, sometimes with other games. They have card pages. Christian's card page is BadBuke767. Uh, Connor's card page, well, he doesn't really have one at the moment. His Jeep's gone. He has a new car. I will update it when he like decides to put up an Instagram page for it. Um, to uh, sending, donating to my PayPal. It's supposed to help me out with getting Get me being able to do that and I'll also get more games uh, to reactions to. I want to get the PS5, uh, I'll do a review on it and then also the games for it. Um, more camera, better camera equipment uh, and a few other things to help make the views a little bit better. And then uh, uh, I will try putting up my own merch store at some point. I just need time to do it. I'm in the middle of baseball right now. I will figure out some way to do it. I do not have a laptop myself at the moment. So if you guys could help me out by donating to my PayPal, it would be really awesome. But besides that, um, if you really enjoy my nerdy, funny, gaming, uh, workout, uh, sports videos, other stuff like that. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.